Hi, I'm James Schellinglaw up here in Alaska. We're in Deep Bay and uh, we just we're on the next to last day of a wonderful cruise on Uncruise Adventures Wilderness Legacy. And I'm here with Skiba, who is our expedition leader. She's the one who devises everything we do each day. And if you're wondering, what do you do on this kind of cruise? We're going to find out about it all from Skiba and more on Insider Travel Report. Now, Skiba, first of all, this has been a marvelous cruise so far. We only got one day left, but I have tried to experience everything I can. Sometimes it was a little aggressive, and that's one of the things I want to talk about it, because you really have a lot of different levels uh, that you can have adventures here, right? Yes, absolutely. We try to, on a daily basis, accommodate everyone's level of adventure. So if you are feeling like you just kind of want to go walk on a beach and our beaches look like this, that's right behind me. It's not, it's not a swimming beach, by the way. I, I asked, I, I have done a swim though. We won't talk about that right now, but that's. Yeah, we won't talk about that. <laughs> but yeah, so we try to accommodate everything. We do everything from, you know, basic walks. And I try to get, we try to get everyone's kind of level that they want to experience that day. Right. And we do try to divide the guests into those levels as best as we can. And we do also offer a bit Hardier excursions that we call bushwhacks if you yeah, want a more and, intense. And, and I did a bushwhack. I, I, I was supposed to do another one. I did a, a first one, and I, I got to tell you, it was a wonderful experience, but it is not easy, and it is going straight uphill, no paths, right? <laughs> that is correct. You are climbing over and around trees, through blueberry bushes. We really don't know what to expect in the forest that we're going to be going into uh, in every location, so it's truly an adventure. Yeah, and it really is, and so we had a marvelous ex experience there, and then... I did an all-day kayaking, which meant I kayaked all morning to a point, a beach uh, that was, uh, uh, and we were actually, we're up here, the, the snow is, is very late here. There's a lot of snow, right? Yes, yes, correct. This was actually our snowiest winter on record, second snowiest on record. Right. Yeah. So we, we got there and we're basically, and that's where I took a little bit of a tumble in the water. But hey, you know, you gotta get you gotta get a little gotta get a little boot water if you if you want to be uh, christened here in Alaska, right? Yeah, that's I guess that's true. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, so I got I got my boot water and I got side. But that was an amazing excursion because it was literally all day long and we had a little lunch on the beach, right? So that's a little more extreme, right? Yes, absolutely. And depending on what boat you're on, we do try to offer anywhere from one, two, three all days. So that means. That you do an all-day excursion one to three days of the week and that's anywhere from an all-day kayak or we mix in a bushwhack in there and yeah, it's kind of like the olympics of alaska so you know i was i was because i actually unfortunately I, I got i got a little i didn't decided not to go the next day but i was going to do a kayak lunch and a bushwhack which is really you know that's extreme right? that is pretty that is very extreme yes that but, is for our hardy folks and so but you don't have to and we do have some some more matured guests who who and and I'll, i think this is the misnomer i want to get across is that you can have be you know at any level and have a great time up here because you're right next to the glaciers you're right and you can see beautiful sights where you see what, what's behind us or you can really have that extreme adventure right that is correct, yeah. And we also offer things like skiff tours, so if you're not feeling super active that day, we can drive well, you around. That was me yesterday. I, I was fine with the skiff tour. You know? And that's perfect. You get to go far and you get to go fast. So. And then there's a walk, so we did a, a walk along the beach, which is doesn't sound, it's it can be a rocky beach. It's got lots of critters on it or seafood critters. Well, we talk about, and we're all looking for critters up here, right? That is correct. Every day we are looking for critters. Yep, that's what we do. And then so we have, if, if someone sees a whale uh, off the ship, Everybody goes and goes like last night we were having a lecture on Alaska and the poor guy who was giving the lecture, Matt, uh, suddenly su suddenly he was there was nobody in the audience because there's a whale and and it was actually Dan, uh, your owner and yeah. CEO, uh, you know, he 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 was out there saying there's a whale we got to go right. Mm -hmm. Yep, that is correct and we that's our focus is you know seeing this great wildlife this great nature that's what we want people to experience. Yeah. Now the other thing is you can do uh, free kayak and also paddleboard, right? That is correct. Yeah, so what we do is we anchor in places that are a little more protected and we give people boundaries. So we set them so we know that we can see everyone and we feel like it's a relatively safe place and we, we set people out and they can kind of come and go as they please. And that's a really great experience. And that means that you can also take out a paddleboard. So if you're really adventurous. 
No, and you it, should it, take out a paddleboard. Yeah, well, I don't know if I'm that adventurous because even in uh, in in warmer climes, I've tried a paddleboard and I just can't quite balance yet. I don't know what it is about it; I never could. Uh, so I, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a, a, a pass on that one for now. Although, unless you, something if you, if you taught me, maybe I'd be able to do it, right? Oh, we teach we we give you a little rundown before we send you out, but it's very much you go for it. <laughs> and then, of course, you know what's it, the the, the uh, legacy is pulling. Uh, they call it a sea dragon, which is just full with kayaks, these wonderful, very up-to-date kayaks, and that takes everything. And then so you have to get on the sea dragon, and then you go in your kayak, you go in your skiff, uh, you, you go in your paddleboard, and, and it really there's a lot to do in, in, in there. But anything else you want to tell our travel advisors about what their clients can experience? Yeah, so I live in southeast Alaska. I live in Juneau, and the things that we get to do on these boats are things that people who live here never get to see. You're going to places that most people will never get the opportunity to visit and it really is a wilderness experience and we really do try to cater to all activity levels so it's a great it's a really great company and we have great boats and a great crew. And you get yeah. up and when we we're in Glacier National Park the other day we got to get right up and close to the glaciers we saw the, the ice falling in the calving that comes down which is you know everybody knows about it but when you're in a small boat next to it uh, it's I'm not talking about the kayak this is the bit the legacy uh, you can paddle in front of another glacier it's a little farther out and it's safer yep. uh, but these are the kind of experiences that I mean the big ships are wonderful they're great they're, they're, they got a, a place and they bring people and expose them. But I guess the, the next level is this kind of experience with Uncruise Adventures. And we've been lucky enough because this is one of your first, second, yeah. third cruises, right? Yeah, this is our basically our second cruise of the season. Yeah, we just this boat just got up here from Seattle. Well, and they're going to go all summer. So if they have any space, it's about time for you to mm -hmm. tell your clients, if you want to get up close and per personal with Alaska this season, uh, come on board Uncruise Adventures, come on board the Wilderness legacy and and come see Skiba. she will outfit you out get you get your your life jackets all the stuff going they will teach you what to do uh, they have a, a little session at the beginning to teach you about the kayaks to teach you about the wilderness things and it is a marvelous experience well Skiba, I want to thank you it's been a great experience uh, I have not been in Alaska in years but this is a totally different thing for me awesome well thank you for being here it's been a good week it's been a great week, and I'm James Schillinglaw, and this is Insider Travel Report.